Hey, Sig and Josh, how are you this morning? Fantastic, Good. fabulous, nothing spectacular. How are you doing? Uh, hey, listen, I'm doing as best as I can in this situation. Uh, congratulations on the new show. Before we get to, to this one, I have to ask you guys, um, I'm calling you from Canada, from Toronto, and we, of course, get Deadliest Catch here on Discovery Channel. It, it is one of our most popular shows on Discovery. Why do you think we are all so fascinated with this, sh with this show? That's easy. Everybody wants to live vicariously through us. Everybody wants to pretend they can be a man. That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you, you wrap that up in a nutshell for me. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> wow. But seriously, uh, it is scary stuff, you guys. Like, do you ever get scared? Does a yes. fat baby fart? <laughs> you know, uh, <laughs> uh, no, I can lie to you and tell you what a man I am, and I never get scared. But uh, yeah. that's just like saying I don't have big ears and a big nose. That's just something that's not logistical. Yeah, yeah, no, absolutely. No, we do love. We, listen, I'm glad that you guys are taking it for the team, is all I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, let's talk about let's talk about this new season, this um, Deadly Catch Bloodline. This is the uh, spinoff, obviously, of, of the popular show, Deadly Catch. Uh, so, Josh, why don't you start? Give us a little bit of background as to how this came about and what we're going to see. Well, you know, uh, we were remodeling our boat. Found some charts underneath my dad's bed that we hadn't seen in a long time, along with a bunch of other random things that were stashed underneath there. And, uh, yeah, I, I was joking around one day during lunch after we found them. I was kind of going through like 50, probably 50 charts in there. And there was a couple of them that were really marked up, and they were of charts of Hawaii. And I was like, yeah, let's go find this these spots out here and check it out. You know, it's warm, too. And, uh yeah, that actually we were joking, and a couple of days later, I was on a plane, and we started to go check it out. And I didn't really know what we were getting ourselves into, and, or what we were going to find. But uh, we found a lot of really cool stuff. And come to find out, I suck at fishing uh, for fish. That is. <laughs> yeah, for um, fish. Yeah. He's been he's been chasing his old man's tail since he was in diapers. Come on, he's still trying <laughs> to figure it out. <laughs> Yeah, well, that, that's okay. That's okay to, to live up to what your dad gave us. I mean, my goodness, uh, amazing legend in, this, in, this, in the industry. And and big for you. Listen, you went through a health scare just last year. I hope everything's okay with you. And, and what compels you to keep going? Uh, <laughs> pride, greed, stupidity. <laughs> um you know, I'm not just going to hand the keys over to anybody. Let's let's be honest here. Um, but I, I do, I feel like, you know, we have a family, uh, I'm not going to say the legacy, but uh, a family business that I want to make sure is going to be protected. And the day yeah. I do leave this world, you know, I want to make sure that everyone's going to be safe and sound. And, and that's just it. That's my responsibility. I look at it that way. Honest to God. Uh, other than that, uh, you know, I'm going to hang off a little bit, but uh, it, it really sucks having to give a little bit all the time. It's like everybody wants the throne. Everybody's trying to try to kick me off the damn chair. I don't know what to do, but uh, I'm going to fight it to the bitter end. How about that? Well, listen, <laughs> we want that. that. There's no question about that. So you, keep keep it going and stay healthy. There's no question. Why, why does it work so well with the two of you guys, huh? Huh. Well, you know, I'm just a couple of fries short of a happy meal, and I'll tell you what, uh, I, I get along with pretty much anybody. I make people smile so I look like a cartoon character, and, uh, you know, I'm a little bit of a hard ass when we get out on the ocean. So, there it is. Yeah. I'd like to say something. I, I'm just saying, uh, you asked him how we get along so well. I'm just saying, uh, I remember, you know, before uh, Josh's father uh, passed, you know, uh, Phil was a good buddy and uh, of yeah. mine. And uh, he was uh, beloved by the fleet. So, you know, to see, uh, uh, you know, his bloodline and the next generation, I mean, you know, I, I don't like to say it every day. I won't because I don't want to swell their heads. But, you know, everybody's proud of it. And uh, I think it's wonderful that they can do that. Oh, I appreciate absolutely. 
Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. I just love watching you guys. It's really fascinating what you do. I really, uh, gosh, thank you for doing it. No, I don't have to. That's all I have to say. I got to ask you guys, listen, you spend a lot of time in isolation. This is just what happens when you go out and do these things. And your advice can't come at a better time right now. We're all in isolation. We Some people just are having a hard time with it. What is your best advice on, on how to handle being on your own and staying isolated? Well, I would say if you know there's a there's a huge storm going on out there, don't go out. <laughs> like, I mean, that's pretty <laughs> simplistic. I mean, that's like uh, us seeing 60 foot seas out there. You, would, you know, you just don't want to go out there. Uh, you know, we're only a couple weeks away from this passing. But uh, while you're stuck inside, just remember one thing. We've got two awesome shows on Discovery Channel that are starting to premiere on Tuesdays. So just uh, if you want to see more of this cartoon looking face or see more of Sig probably yelling at me uh, somewhere along the lines, well, Tuesdays. <laughs> it's coming. Discovery Channel. And okay. for me, yeah. for me, it's like uh, don't sit there and cry. You can't go on a date. You can't go to the park. You can't go to the movies. <laughs> Wham! <laughs> I mean, look, I'm sorry, but, you know, I mean, uh, you know, I, we've been gone. I've been, I've been gone 10 months in a stretch in a confined yeah. space. Uh, but, yes, we were chasing money. We were chasing crap. So we had a goal. Um, you know, obviously, we feel terrible for the people that are out of work, uh, terrible for those who are home alone. That being said, uh, just remember, you know, stick to the common goal. You know, you, everyone has a goal. And if you and if you just remember that, I think you'll be all right, and we'll get through this. Honestly. No, I think you. This is one. That's wonderful advice, and you are absolutely right. We we have a lot. We all have a lot to be thankful for. Uh, but we are really thankful for you bringing us Deadliest Catch, and we are so looking forward to Deadliest Catch Bloodline. And uh, uh, listen, we hope to see you guys on the seas forever. Thank you so much, and and your Canadian fans really thank you. Oh, love Canada. Thank you guys very much. Thanks, guys. Okay. You, thank you. Stay safe and stay healthy, you guys. Take care and thanks for everything. Bye-bye. Thank you.